Yo, what's going on guys? Sean Boyle here with Momentum360 and this week I'm going to teach you how to publish a 360 photo on Facebook. If you haven't yet, stop, go to YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, wherever you're watching this from, click notifications and go to post notifications and turn them on as well as YouTube. Click that little bell so whenever we post a new video, you are the first person to know. So how you go about doing this is really simple. What you need to do, and I kind of touched on this last week, right, when I instructed on how to become a Google trusted photographer, you need to actually go on Google Street View and remember how I was telling you guys, if you didn't watch the video, you can watch it right here. We'll put a little image which you can click and then watch the video. But if you take your phone on Google Street View, you're going to have to shoot up all the way to the ceiling, down all the way to the floor. And obviously you're gonna to have to do a 360. So all of those scans in between count as a 360 photo. It takes about a minute, minute and a half, two minutes to actually do this, so really short time. But once you finish it, you're gonna have one 360 photo on Google in which you could post from there what you can do. And this is pretty exciting. I posted this about a couple days ago, and this is actually uh, Savona. They're an Italian restaurant in Golf Mills. I shot the virtual tour uh, I think like a year ago. So really cool place. Uh, shout out to Johan Zanier. That's the owner. He's one of the best guys in the world. Really humble, but produces a pretty amazing product. So even though this is a little blurry, this is still a tremendous place. I would recommend you guys check out Savona Golf Mills. We'll put that uh, text right there so you can check it out. A couple pictures of it would be nice too. Um, so what else? So what you need to do is take that 360 photo. It's better you do it on your phone than your desktop, but just because, um, well, for me, I actually have a Lenovo, but for uh, people who are using a Mac, it would probably be a little bit better uh, if you did a Mac. Apple is pretty superior when it comes to the AI technology. So what you need to do is take your iPhone or Mac, whatever you're gonna do, and we'll post a little video right here walking through how to do that. So you're gonna take the photo, you're gonna publish it to Facebook. It's gonna say 360, once you're good to go with that, you can literally, post it and look around and it shows you all of those little uh, snippets. So for instance, if I had my phone and it was going straight like this, I can move it up and down. So if I moved it up, it would look like that. If I went down, it would look like that to the floor. So it directs exactly how you move your phone or computer. So it's so freaking cool. I love it. And it's just a nice little way to show off your property or restaurant, retail space, whatever you're trying to do, it's fantastic. So that's how you do it. It's really, really simple. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, please let me know. I'm actually gonna be making two videos this week because this one was so short. That, so if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you haven't yet, throw a like on the video, subscribe, you know what to do. I love making these videos and I love adding value to my customers and clients. So. Thank you guys so much for the support and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.